What's up guys, Swordsman here, and I am bringing you some more League of Legends gameplay. It, uh, it's a jungle game. I am not typically found in the jungle all that often. Uh, I typically go support or top lane, or uh, maybe some AD, you know. But, uh, yeah, I am playing jungle Maokai. This was actually, uh, my first ever champion that I actually purchased. I'm gonna stack my saplings here at the wolves. Messed up my skill order here after I killed Blue a little bit. I, I kind of panicked and just tried to click quickly and stuff. But um, yeah, I'm actually joined in this game with uh, Jay Kaiser and Atheo. I tried to come up there and gank Karthus, but uh, I believe we made him blow his flash. So I'm gonna go back to base and uh, see if we can come back and do it again. Oh, no. Oh, oh yeah, I remember this. I actually waffled around a little bit with whether or not I wanted to go back or try to clear a camp and get level 3 before I head back. That's how I can go right for the gank. And I believe I picked this up and then I'm going to go back. Pick up, uh, something. Oh, I got boots and a ward. Always useful. And we're going to motor into red. Yeah, yeah. And I'm coming. Oh, Shaco. Hello, Shaco. Oh, yeah. 1v1. Malkai and Shaco. I suppose we technically traded, but, um... Joke's on him, because, damn it, I thought I'd lose that outright, but uh, I did get level 4 off of that in the, I'm going to come back here to Karthus, Jay is in uh, mid lane as Vladimir, that wiry uh, little vampire, just taking a look, no Karthus yet, nothing to do, so I'm just going to mosey on up here, and see what, I think, do I go to help top lane, yeah, I'm coming to help Athale, he's up here on Jax, one of my other favorite uh, champions, I'm gonna scope this guy out here. He jumps on him. I do my advance. He stuns him, and all right, we picked up an easy kill. That uh, my first successful gank of this game. Though I suppose making uh, Karthus blow flash is considered successful, and hey, I'll take it. I'm not gonna be greedy. Go down here and clear my wolves. Hit level five. Hit these race, and then I believe I'm gonna be looking to see what I can do at bottom lane. I'm gonna sneak into this bush. And see if I can make it up here to do anything to Corky. That was a bit of a fail flash. I'm not gonna lie. I, I, I probably. I, I don't know if I hit the terrain or what, but that definitely wasn't how I had envisioned that working out in my head. Oh, oh, we got Shaco down here. Do we get him? No, I think he. I think he gets scared off because we saw him. All right, gonna get out of there now. Get my Philo Stone and another Ward and Crystal. Oh, that little bitch trying to take my blue. What the fuck? That just ain't cool, man. That is not cool. I, I call for Jay to come help because I'm not sure where this guy is. He might... Yeah, there he is. Ah, get him. Get him. I'll let Jay chase him while I try to get the blue. And I do safely get the blue. And it looks like... Uh, like Alright, cool. Jay, we actually got Lee Sin who came in there. Do you guys like to jungle? I find jungling to be one of the more interesting roles in League of Legends. Uh, it's not so much about last hitting, it's more... It takes it away from the tedious aspect of trying to farm last hits and puts it more into uh, thinking about what you're doing and being very careful with um, uh, how you approach things, when you go for ganks, how you control drag. It, it turns the game into more of a thinking game instead of a, a balance between... Uh, smart play and just tedious last hitting. So I think that's kind of why it appeals to me. Compound that by the fact that I'm bad at last hitting. It's like, yep, that fits. Gonna, I was trying to get uh, Lee Sin, but Shaco came up my way again. Gonna advance to him, drop a sapling, go get him sapling. Oh, those saplings do so much damage. Oh, damn, I lost him. But we do possibly get a Lee Sin kill here, do we? Oh, that was a bad flash by him. Should have blew that up before he got out of there, but I think we can die. Yeah, we dive this shit. We're going balls deep on this dude. Karthus tries to scare us off, but nothing's working. Oh, am I gonna get outplayed? Am I gonna get outplayed? Damn, we mutual. Oh, that was that was rough. All right, fast forward this bitch again through. Lee Sin definitely almost got me. We were exchanging how close that was. Um, here are my wraiths again. I, I mean, I am not the greatest jungler, but do what I can. 
try to. I, I believe we forced a flash out of Vlad. Or not Vlad, wow, Karthus. I'm gonna wander down here and plant a ward, or I thought I was going to. Oh, wait, no, I planted a ward in the middle for Shaco. Run into him and the dragon. Working on kicking his ass. Throw down my ult. Now pop it, pop it, pop it. Damn it. I never pop it before they get out. I gotta work on that. I really, really do. Now, in theory, bottom lane knows I'm coming, but I figured I'd come down here anyway. Bit of a show of force, despite being low on, on mana. Twisted advance to him. Come on, Ari. Can you get the kill? Can we get a kill? No? Yes? Ah, she did. Fuck yes. All right, speed this up a little bit. Get back going here. For any of you guys that actually want to play this game, uh, you, it is completely free, like I said before. This game is free. It's fun. Uh, you don't have to spend a single cent playing it if you don't want to. And if you want to sign up, I will leave a link down in the description. You can register and come play. Uh, what else? I am hoping to have some open lobbies in this game. I want to do... Uh, some some uh, custom games called Arabs. I would like to do those with some fans and uh, have some fun with that. But in order to do that, I need more of my subscribers that are actually playing this game and want to do that type of stuff. So uh, feel free to register and come have fun. All right, what am I got now? I got my heart of gold. Upgraded my tier two boots. Get me another ward. Go and uh, clear my one. That. I, I smite way too early with these things, I really do. I should pay more attention to timing. I also don't work super well on keeping track of timers, but... It is what it is, as Athena would like to say. Alright, let's do some farming. I think I'm doing relatively good. He did steal my red. Bit of a bummer about that. Now, in theory, Maokai is capable of stealing people's shit in their jungle, but I didn't really want to risk it because being so new to jungling, I, I, just, I just didn't want to. Um, it would have been cool if I could, because my saplings do pack a lot of damage. You can see I'm level 10, Jay's level 10, so if I'm keeping up with Jay in levels, I'm definitely doing pretty good. I flash in there on him, his flash is down. Atheo gets a stun, oh, and we get kicked away. But, I mean, I'll take it. I used my flash, he used his flash. That should, in theory, help Thale out a little bit. Get me some jungler attacks. Uh, toss the sapling, and then I'm heading back to my wolf to keep farming. Because even though it's more, it's a lot about ganks and everything, you still got to work on getting that farm build up and uh, seeing what you can do. Alright, did we dive this? No. I don't think we died this. I wanted to do Dragon there, but now Shaco's down here. I pound him a little bit. Where did he go? We sins in the bush. We're in a pretty rough spot right here, but you know, best you can do sometimes. Did we actually fight this? I don't think so. I think we just trade stuff for a little bit. Oh, I, I went in. Holy shit. Did I ever. Whenever Jake can pick that up. I think I get Jake killed there. Yeah, I definitely got Jake killed. Sorry, Jay. My bad. My bad, man. Whoops. Alright, farm my double drones. Circle back here and try to defend bottom tower a little bit. How am I doing on CS? I have 76 farm, uh, Shaco has 46, so I'm definitely uh, ahead of there. I have two kills and six assists. He has five kills though, but he has six deaths. So I don't know, maybe he's more ahead on uh, actual gold, but I'm doing pretty good clearing my camps compared to him. All right, so we died. That was a two for one by the looks of it. Big fight up top. I didn't think I needed to go there, but so I just figured it'd be safer to get my blue. I'm over here, grab a red. Now I've got double buffs, and I'm gonna be looking to uh, try and fuck somebody up. All right, free dragon off of those two kills. Shake us in the bushes. Come on. One of the things I like about Maokai is that. His, his toolkit down here is very, very good. Like, you have damage without needing damage items. You have an interrupt, a minor knockback with a snare. 
you have a, a gap closer to initiate, you have a dam an AoE damage reduction and an AoE nuke with your ultimate. It's it just seems like a very versatile jungler, and yeah. his ganks are strong, his jungle clearing is strong, and I, I'm not entirely sure why more people don't use him. I'm trying to talk Stone into using him more because I think he fucking rocks. Those saplings do a lot of damage. But right here, we're just playing slap and tickle at the mid lane and uh, seeing what we can do. Uh, the lane phase is... Oh shit! Big fight! Big fight! Blow up my ult! Blow up my ult! Why don't I blow up my ult? There we go. Blew that shit up for big damage. See, the way his ult works is that when you put it down, it reduces 35% of the damage that takes place within that circle. And then whenever I turn it off, when it ends, it does like 200-some um, damage at max rank, plus a portion of damage for, for all of the damage that it, it prevented, it absorbed while that was going on. So it can become pretty powerful in a team fight with all that damage going down in if I can position it correctly. Here I wasn't completely sure. I wanted to go up here to see if I can get their blue. Just try to steal it when it came up. Uh, I believe I'm interrupted by Shaco. Yeah, there's Shaco. I toss a sapling and Ron's like, peace, homie. I'm good. Don't got mana to fight this. I won the Corky, but it was uh, mostly for not. Ouch. Poor Jay. Damn that carcass. There's more slap and tickle going on around our mid lane. Uh, us three weren't completely sure how we should approach this with having Ari and Teemo, uh, like, not being with us, not being in our Skype call or whatever, so... We did start to play a little bit more defensively because we did feel we were definitely in a pretty solid lead. Gave a Theo blue buff because uh, Vladimir doesn't need it. Um, and Ari wouldn't come for it, so... If I ping for you to come for a blue and you don't come, sorry, it is no longer my concern. It's just the way it works. I'm not going to stick around tanking that for an hour. Go, sapling! Bam! God, I love those saplings. Such outrageous poke. They just are so good. Speed this up a little bit. Keep, uh... Oh, oh, we're seizing the tower a little bit. Pushing them back while we do some damage to it. Ari comes in from the bottom lane. Thales down low. Keep tossing my saplings. That's, that's what you do as Maokai. Just toss the sap... Oh, Jay went balls deep. Me, Ari, and Teemo work on the tower. Pretty easy tower. Gonna check their red. No red. That makes me sad. So I'm gonna head up top here and get some farm. Got my Shirelius now, my Aegis. Things are going pretty good. See, I mean, look at that. Like, I am a tanky jungling initiator, and I can clear waves like nobody's business. That, that to me, is power. Not, not every jungler can do that. Some of them can, you know. I'm not saying it's only Maokai, but it just seems like his toolkit really, really suits my playstyle that I enjoy. I don't know what Lee Sim was thinking. We were all waiting in the bush. And, uh, go sapling, go! Yes! You got him. 230 damage. Kill this wards that way they have less vision. It's like they didn't realize we could see them, and it was just bad news for them. Thales on a rampage. Way to go, buddy. Alright. So far, so good. I believe we get another free dragon. I only got cost three kills. No, I didn't. Alright, I am up to, what, 122 farm, Shaco's at 80, he has 7 kills, I have 3 and 9 assists, I'll take it. Shaco having 0 assists surprises me. Seems like a lone wolf then, which, uh, I'll take that. Ari did get picked off for being a little greedy, but, I mean, what can you do, it's Ari. Toss the sapling over, do my twisted units. I love getting over walls that way if there's an enemy there. It definitely works. So... Thales farming top, so I just grab blue for my own mana regen so I can spam my saplings and my ult a bit longer and uh, should work out fairly well. Alright, so we're looking here. We want to we want to win a team fight and then go for Baron. Jay's uh, playing slap and tickle up top here. We're trying to dance around their, their poke. All of a sudden Lee Sin goes on him. We come in. I'm going to put down my ult. Twisted advance on the corky. Try to shut him down. I turn with my Q, and oh my god, Jay's on a- Oh, triple kill! Quad! Oh my fucking god, a pentakill. Wow. I witnessed a pentakill in League of Legends, and it was done by Jay Kaiser. 
Oh my god. That was one of the greatest moments I have ever witnessed in League of Legends, and I was so happy to be a part of that. That was just such... That was just maximum badassery, man. That was so fucking awesome. Uh, so, well done to Mr. J. Kaiser getting his pentakill, the D-Crew first in a real game. And uh, I thought I did uh, reasonably okay for a low-level uh, Maokai jungle play. Take care, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Feel free to sign up. Guild Wars 2 footage soon.